right here, because it's the only dark corridor in the room. I was gonna hold down my sneaky key. Be sneaky. Uh. Come on, Officer Fishman. Come on! There you go. You're gonna run right up to me, aren't you? Yep. Son of a bitch. <laughs> They're doing snooping around here. Get out! Get out! And what have you got there? Trying to take evidence from the scene? Hand them over! Officer Fishman! Fish you! Fish you, man! Son of a bitch! <laughs> Thank you, Jack, for summing up exactly what I was feeling. Okay, I have no idea what I'm supposed to do here. I have. Uh. Frustrating. What I gotta do, I just can't do it. It won't open. It won't open. Some fisherman moment. Maybe I'm supposed to like find a way to open the door from this side? Open a door from over here? Maybe? Maybe not? Oh, this is no. Nope, that's not I thought it was. I thought that was not cup can't close it. Oh, here's the door. It'll be locked. It won't yeah. open. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. Uh, there's gotta be some place to hide. Uh it was talking about being sneaky before. And the name of this game is Stealthiness. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. Just sit down and think. Hi, Officer Fishman. I'm gonna follow you. Oh, alright, alright, alright. I'm backing off, I'm backing off. Am I on the side? I'm not on the side. I'm on the side. I'm not on the side. No, he's pissed off, he's gonna watch me. Uh, this. Oh, and I'm hearing voices again. I don't know what they're telling me to do. It won't budge. Hearing voices again, folks. It's creeping me out. Alright, I'm gonna save game. I'm gonna save game and then I'm gonna. Save, yes. I am going to. Alright, I'm gonna. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm gonna stop for now. I'm gonna come back to this later. So. The door's bolted shut. For this has been a uh, let's blind play. Call of Cthulhu Dark Corners of the Earth. Uh, this has been my first. I've played the, the uh, first level and now I'm stuck on the second. Uh, I'll catch you later. Adios! Okay, everybody, I think I fixed the sound issues I was having before. I tried to adjust them so you could hear me better. It turns out I made it though so that you couldn't hear me well at all because I. I changed one volume thing up and one volume thing down. I thought it would count, would uh, be okay. Apparently it wasn't. So uh, now we got this going on here. Crouch. And I'm still pretty much stuck on this part, though. Though I do have an idea. If we uh, if I want a decent snoop around, I'd better do something to block that door. <sighs> all right, all right. Perhaps I could use them to block the door. To give me more time to look around. Alright. Let's use the shelves to block the door to look around. Alright. Assorted pick. Can't see anything of use. So, blocking the door to give myself more time to look around, but I don't. Still do not know what I'm supposed to do. So I, guess I, bet, I guess I better just, you know, enable myself to get on that time limit. There's a bottle of bootleg rum and a wooden handle. Alright, so... Now it won't open. Now he's begun breaking down the door. And I try to find some way out of here. Why would Brian force entry when he had a set of keys? 
It won't open. Oh, wait, 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 wait. It looks like I need some sort of lifting handle to get it open. Uh, I figured it out. I figured it out. I know what to do. I know what to do now. I know what to do now. Get her out! Them things don't belong to you. I'll be taking them back. Okay, okay, I know what to do. I got it. I got it. Okay, everybody, the don't panic. I got it. Snooping around. Let's follow fish I need man. to be more careful. Okay, so we gotta follow Lieutenant Fishman, grab the handle, use the handle to escape through the trap door, and then we're good to go. Alright. Now we're in business, baby. Yeah! Okay, hold on, hold on. I gotta wait for Lieutenant Fishman to wander around. Let's get, uh. Snake back over here. I'll see Lieutenant Fishman walk past. Take a drink of my yummy soda. Oh, it's good soda. Okay, doggy, there he goes. Quick, go. Come on, let's go. I'm excited now. I know how to, I know what to do. Okay, open door. Close door. Quick, Resident Evil 4 trick. Pushing, 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 pushing. Let's speed up. Okay. So now we go grab. Okay. There's a bottle of bootleg rum and a wooden handle. Okay. Oh, he's coming, he's coming. He's coming. It probably leads uh, down to a storage. I know you do. Uh, okay, here we go. Now we escape! 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 What are you doing? Escape! There we go. Ah! Holy crap! Um... I'm not sure if I was supposed to do it that way. Ah, oh, guess I was. Whoever's down there, you can rock! Thank you, Lieutenant Fishman. Ugh. <sighs> okay, so the friendly chief of police there won't help us. Medical kit, a book. Oh, damn. It looks like a diary. It's gotta have some clues. Okay, I'm not gonna read you guys the full thing. You know, if you wanna read it, if you want the entire thing read out to you, you can go watch someone else's Let's Play or buy the damn game. I'm not gonna read this whole damn thing out for you. So, I'm gonna... I'm gonna open the journal. Okay, I'm gonna... That's that I've read. Okay, missing entries. Completely unable to call what happened to me. Car comes. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna skip. I'm gonna. I'm gonna skip. I'm gonna stop recording. I'm gonna read all this stuff. Then I'm gonna come back and summarize for you guys. Cause I don't want to waste all this time just reading it. So, just hold on a minute. Okay, here we go. Basic sum up of what just happened. Of what I've just. Sorry. First of all, missing entries. Basically. Between our six years in Arkham Asylum, we received back a journal that tells us of all this crap that we've done over the years. However, there are some missing pages. We're not sure who took them out. We might have done it. Or maybe the, uh, maybe the, the treatment people over there did it. We're not sure. We don't know. We're going to find out. Also, general evidence. We have the Arkham out Boston here, which is talking about Mr. Arthur. Very disturbing turn of events. And, you know, the fact that he's setting up a... a he's going to recently set up a branch... The new branch for the uh, National Grocery Store here is very new. It wasn't here very long. And then we have the Diary of Brian Burdo, which talks about how it was a slow day at the store, how nothing ever came out of here. The place is dead. There are no stores ever open for business. But he has found a lady friend. Won't be long before we're both out of here. She's the one good thing about Innsmouth. I'm guessing the only thing I can think of is that it's that one lady we were talking to, but she wouldn't say anything. Because she's the only one who seemed like she wasn't about to, you know, sprout gills and tear our face off. 